All right, today we're going to learn a specific phrase. Uh, we're going to learn how to say, don't be afraid of making mistakes. So the context of the situation was I was trying to give advice to someone in Chinese and I wanted to say, uh, don't be afraid of making mistakes. Uh, I, I knew how to say the don't be afraid part, but was unclear about how to say making mistakes. So the answer is, 不要怕犯错误. Don't be afraid of making mistakes. And so the two learning points uh, in this sentence is the pattern 不要, and then plus verb, and then also the verb 犯. So we'll start with the pattern 不要 plus verb, and this means don't verb. So this is a command, and so a command is when you're telling someone to do something. And in this case, uh, 不要 plus verb is a negative command. So you're telling someone not to do something. Don't do whatever that verb is. So for example, don't move is 不要动, since 动 is to move. So since uh, 怕 is, means to be afraid, 不要怕 is the command, uh, don't be afraid. And I also want to mention, uh, so in our English sentence, we have don't be afraid of. This of doesn't have a character in Chinese. Uh, so we can just uh, continue with the rest of the sentence. So 不要怕 plus some phrase means don't be afraid of uh, that phrase. So when translating to English, uh, the of is just added by itself uh, to make the sentence natural in English. Uh, now we'll go to the second part, uh, and we'll first go over what means. So means mistake or error. And if you look at the first character here, means wrong. So usually with the characters, there's always some way to relate uh, what, what each individual word means with the entire word. So if to means mistake, then how do we say make a mistake, to make a mistake? Then we have to add the verb fun before to to get fun to, uh, which means to make a mistake. Uh, so fun is used with words related to making a mistake, committing a crime, or breaking the rules. And some other examples of uh, words with fun in it are fun to commit a crime. So zui actually means crime. So fun fun is like a verb, like kind of like to do, and then zui we have as a crime, so kind of to do a crime, in English we'd say to commit a crime. Second, we have uh, fun ren. So ren means person, and we can think of this fun as uh, something related to one of these three things. So in this case, it's related to committing a crime. So fun ren is someone who has committed a crime. So that would be a criminal. And our last example, we have fun fa to break the law. And we should know that this fa comes from the word fa lu, uh, which means law. So this fun uh, also has this kind of to do sense, but also it has a negative sense. So if you're doing something negative with the law, then you are breaking the law. That's how I, I would think about it. Uh, and I also just wanted to mention that uh, if we didn't include fun, uh, if we just said 不要怕错, this is still correct. It just means don't be afraid of mistakes instead of uh, saying uh, don't be afraid of making mistakes. So then we can combine uh, 不要怕 
which means don't be afraid, and fan tou, which means making mistakes or to make a mistake, to get bu yao pa fan tou. Don't be afraid of making mistakes. So if you want to tell someone to not be afraid of making mistakes, now now you know how to say it. Uh, and so just make sure you've learned the two learning points. Bu yao plus verb gives you a negative command to tell someone not to do something. And then this fun is kind of like to do something in a negative sense and is related to making mistakes, committing a crime, or breaking the rules. Uh, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you.